Hey guys, what's up? This is Recreational420, and today we're going to check out this THC Bomb Concentrate, or not Concentrate, THC Bomb Terpene Icing by Blue Roots, which so far, uh, this is the first gram of their Concentrate, and I'm super excited because this is by far the, like, hands down my favorite company for flour right now. Um, so I can only imagine this stuff is going to be amazing. So with that, let's just hop right into it. The THCA is 75.3%. Uh, total TH or THC percentage is 1.41% with your total coming in at 67.48. If you don't understand how to read that, there's going to be a video linked at the bottom of this that kind of explains it and shows you the formula to get that and figure all that out. Um, this is kind of complicated to understand and I can I could totally understand that. So with that, this packaging is pretty cool. I mean, it's just your basic like, you know, container or package or whatever. Um, I like the fact that it's got their logo and design all around it. Uh, it. It's just, they paid attention to detail, basically, trying to keep their brand, like, uni uniform all the way across all brands, if that makes any sense. And they had the score marks, which is nice. You guys know how I feel about those, if you've been following me at all. Um, this part, not so fun. <laughs> struggling, struggling. Ah! <laughs> All right, yeah, we got it open. It'll go, it'll go, there we go. As fun as that was, I, it's still, I, I like the packaging. Um, and this is what it looks like. I like these little containers. This is nice and it's a glass container. Let's see how easy or hard this lid is to take off. Super simple, oh man, that right there. Thank you guys for making sure that these are easy to take off. Um, and with that, you guys can see this is this stuff. It almost has like the same consistency as the terp sugar, but this is more of an icing, like straight up more of an icing type of um, consistency. It's a little thicker. And oh, wow, the smell is super, super piney. Um, piney with a tiny little bit of like uh, earthiness. And when I say earthiness, I don't mean like gross dirtiness. I just literally mean like almost like you could rub a little bit of dirt and just like you could get that scent um oh, wow and it, uh, it also has a splash a tiny little bit of some flower like sweetness but mostly just the sour pininess that comes through so i'm thinking it's going to taste a lot like pine um but with that i'll be back with you guys or i'm gonna go check it out and i'll be back again with you guys in a day or so to let you know how it went Hey guys, what's up? So I went ahead and tried that THC bomb, and I have to say the name says it all. Uh, the the and I'll just hop into it this way. The flavor itself is super super sweet. It's almost like a candy flavor. Like it leaves like a sugary kind of aftertaste with a small like pine flavor behind it. Also, um, it, it's really unique and it tastes really really good. But the reason I'm going to spend about a minute and a half talking about the high <laughs> is because it was insane. I mean, I have to say, I smoke every single night, sometimes it, like in the day. I, I dab nightly from five o'clock to like nine o'clock when I hit the, like hit the hay. I just, there's, I, I smoke on a regular consistent basis. I, I'm not just like, I don't just smoke once. I, I've been smoking for a long time and this stuff hit me harder than almost anything I've ever had before. I took a tiny, and I'm talking my size dab, so like a point maybe on a scale is what it would weigh. And that was enough for me to just like, I, I had that at five o'clock thinking, oh, it's no big deal, it's just another dab, right? And I had that at five o'clock, and for the next two or so hours, I was just lost in my phone. I was so just like, I, I couldn't, it was just everything you want from an indica high. Like I was confused, dazed, lost, and but it wasn't scary or bad or anything. It was just like, oh, I just had to really relax. And I, I wish I would have taken the time instead of like thinking about how high I was the entire time because that doesn't make it any fun for you. <laughs> it's not bad and I didn't have a bad trip. Um, it was amazing. And when I say trip, please, please, please don't think you see things. Don't, you don't visualize anything weird on cannabis. When I say trip, it's just you know, it, it's a two hour, it, it's different than saying drunk or, you know, trip is the way I say intoxication for uh, weed instead of saying high because I, I don't know, that's just the way I say it. I'm sorry. <laughs> but um, yeah, anyway, so 
This is by far, hands down, one of the best concentrates. If you're new to uh, cannabis and definitely if you're new to concentrates, be careful, start with a small amount just so that you don't like overload yourself with this because it is super strong. And um, I, I understand that like a, a medical or a, a, a daily user, somebody who wakes up, dabs, 10 o'clock dab, 11 o'clock dab, before you go to the gym dab, before you go to work dab, whatever. If you're one of those people, this isn't going to affect you that way. But if you're a like true and full recreational user, you smoke on the weekends, you only smoke after work, this thing is going to punch you in the face <laughs> in a good way. I mean, you know, I, I don't know how, how you say punch you in the face in a good way. I don't, I don't think I've ever been punched weekly in the face, but and with that, this has been Recreational 420, and I'll be back again with you guys soon.